Hi there. This is East Studio one-on-one. -on -one. Kelly Kessler speaking here and today we are featuring the work of Potter Helen Hooper Hurst. Hi, that's me. So this is Helen and Kelly talking about some of Helen's work. And Helen, I'm looking here at your pieces and I feel like simultaneously I see some things that look really familiar, like wonderfully comfortable old friends, but then there's something else going on. I feel like there's a lot of imagination at play. And I was wondering, does it feel that way to you? Yes. <laughs> Tell us a little about what you're doing with your pots. Usually I get struck by an idea and it can be anything from what a, a child has made in one of my workshops or even a, a PBS show about ancient, ancient Minoans. And that'll just make my mind go down a road. For example, on this piece, I was exploring um, the boat building of the Minoans, and the and this one was the Egyptians. But then I used motifs to symbolize the Minoan form of water, and I, I just couldn't stop thinking about them. <laughs> So I've noticed been... you have boats on the brain. <laughs> yes, <I do. laughs> it's a very likable trait. Um, well, and the the it's interesting to go from this boat, which seems like it could be for food or serving, to this boat, which seems to have its own purpose. And then those added elements down below make me think of these guys. Now, what happened with these guys here? I was inspired by anemones oh. when I first began these years ago, but then. Okay. Um, I loved how it showed movement in something that was completely still. Mm. And when you can find something that inspires you to also give it a whole nother level of, of visual effect, it's, it's just fun. And this one is, is for the uh, Mohawk Barbershop inspiration here with the little Mohawk on the top. Of is the there street. a Mohawk Barbershop around? Yeah, about, <laughs> about a block away. <laughs> Here in historic Edgefield, we have a Mohawk barbershop. And then a quick peek at these little guys. Where are they off to? They just developed from a, a child who was in one of my little workshops one day. And he had made a bowl that had these feet that reminded me so much of crabs that I just had to, I had to make them. And it looks like they're moving. I just love them. They are off on a walk. Well, this is a great little look at what you're up to. This is You're going to have some of this work at our holiday sale? Absolutely. This is great. Well, I appreciate you sharing this with us. And thanks. Thanks for the great questions. All right.